Well, get ready to say cheese. If you have a pet, you probably take pictures all the time. Yeah, but what about paying for a professional photographer? <laughs> Today on Bentley's Corner, Tim shows us what goes on behind the camera. All right, good morning, guys. I learned pet photography is big business, but it's not always easy to get that perfect shot. Arguably, probably the hardest niche within the photography sector. Well, it is hard. I'm not going to say that it's not hard, um, but that's what makes it worth it, and um, that's the best reward. That's Aaron Bonilla, owner of Bonilla Pet Photography in Chesapeake. We paid a visit to her studios for a one-on-one -on -one with her and Bentley. <laughs> Bentley was awesome to photograph because he's such a happy dog and he just aims to please. Um, he can sit stay, which is like a miracle in the studio. <laughs> it's a passion to be able to capture these images of our beloved pets, but it certainly requires a lot of patience. Most portraits are totally chaotic while they're going on. Bentley's was not as chaotic, but I think you would agree it was still a little bit crazy. Um, and that's how they all are, which is why people are usually amazed at what we're able to capture. <laughs> there are a lot of tricks that Aaron uses, too, in order to grab their attention, like whistles, shaking a bag of treats, even barking like a dog. <laughs> Where's this going? And now it was time for Bentley's proofs. The little boat. <laughs> a salute to the Navy. Here's Bentley in a tiny boat with a sailor's hat. Here's his class photo and a nice profile shot. And of course, he wanted to get one with his dad, you know, with Father's Day coming up and everything. Interested in getting your pet photographed but are worried that they'd be too difficult? Here's what Aaron says to that. Don't be concerned whether or not you can bring your pets into the studio. None of them sit still. And our record is actually photographing 10 cats in one portrait. <laughs> 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 now, Erin doesn't just photograph dogs and cats. She won awards for some of her photography, like a guinea pig riding a motorcycle, mm -hmm. some horses, even a tarantula. Unbelievable. Okay. By the way, that's my favorite Bentley's Quarter. Yeah. Glad you enjoyed yeah. it. That's so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, if you have a story idea, let me know about it. Send me an email or uh, send me a message on social media, and we'll uh, be happy to kind of entertain that.